cars going in every direction. The guys that are on their motorbikes, the scooters, are fending for their lives. This guy, wow, that guy just almost, uh... Run him over. So our next stop in Paris is, is over here at the Arc. And wow, is it ever, like, it's really something in person. You know, photos just don't do it justice for the size and how large it is. What's also interesting here is that, you know, most of the photos I've seen, maybe most of the photos I've seen of the Arc, you know, the intersection is, uh, is empty. Obviously, that would make sense because it's, uh, it, would take for, it would make for a better photo. But now that we're here in the middle of the day and it's just about rush hour, the traffic through this intersection is incredible. I mean, there's cars going in every direction. The guys that are on their motorbikes, the scooters, are fending for their lives. This guy, wow, that guy just almost... Uh, Runs him over. Yeah, this is not a very friendly, very friendly intersection. No, it looks crazy. And you can see the people on the top. We're not sure if we're gonna climb up there or not. We're kind of running out of time. And since we were up in the Eiffel Tower, we had amazing views and an amazing lunch. Crazy. <laughs> Fending for themselves. It's... There's an understanding, like there is in the United States with stop signs, that the cars entering the intersection obviously have the right of way over the cars that are currently in the intersection. But still, we're seeing some crazy shit. Whoa, look at that one. Holy shit, that guy just almost hit that guy. Whoa, look at that uh, Mercedes. Uh, that's, uh, do you see that? It's like a $200,000 Mercedes. I think it's even more. Just wait till we get to Monaco. That's when we're going to see some amazing cars. I saw in the other hotel we saw in London. Look at these guys. There's a reason I'm standing behind this tree, too. I figured if anything gets out of control, I've got a little bit of protection here with this tree. Because the majority of the crazy traffic is coming in that direction. So, that tree might be my best friend if someone gets a little out of hand. Whoa. 